Hi everyone, it's Andrew here again. It's Christmas Eve, I hope you're all keeping safe and well. I'm out for my lunchtime walk around the beautiful Eco Park project not far from where I work at EPGA. I'm just using the Double Take uh, app here for filming today. I've got the ultra wide lens on the front and I've obviously got the selfie one looking at me. You probably don't want to look at me too much anyway. But it's Christmas Eve, it's such a great time of the year. Um, here in Vietnam it's celebrated very little and mainly by the expats so you don't really feel, feel the build up to Christmas like you would do perhaps in Europe um, but it's still here you know shops have got some decorations available and and we're going for a Christmas meal tomorrow at a, at a, at a fantastic place that will be all set up and nice and Christmassy so that'll be great um, but it's come round so fast hasn't it you know tomorrow is literally Christmas Day and I can't believe it I'm very excited we've got all our presents ready Lexi my daughter is absolutely so into it at the moment she's loving it and that's just that's what it's all about isn't it Christmas is really for the children and I consider myself still a big child at heart to be honest so I'm looking forward to tomorrow it's gonna to be an awesome day um, obviously I'm reading a lot in the UK about the Covid tier system and how it's changing a little bit from Boxing Day so please stay safe guys do the best you can for Christmas Day. Have a great day. Stay safe. Look after everybody. Remind everybody you love them and care for them. But obviously following the rules <coughs> that are in place that will help you and help your family stay safe through this tough time. I'm thinking of you all the time, obviously. Uh, we're very lucky here and fortunate in Vietnam, and I know that for sure. Um, yeah, it's a lovely place here, isn't it? Just giving you a, a lovely different view. Uh, obviously generally use the same view every time when I'm walking. I've actually gone on my walk in a reverse order today just to really give a different perspective of my walk but also to make it feel different for me. Obviously doing something different um, with the same journey time is great isn't it? Doing the reverse journey um, it keeps me interested, it keeps me motivated. Um, I'm going to get to Christmas Day under 100 kilos which is great that means I've maintained that level um, and I want to get to the new year at about 98 kg. I think I mentioned that uh, a, a couple of videos back. There's a lovely little football pitch here, artificial turf, beautiful, next to a school. Um, just <laughs> wanted to show you that, it's really nice. They're really into the football here in Vietnam. It's a big sport for them, as it is perhaps around the world for, for a lot of people, but it's, uh, but it's a nice pitch actually. Um, yeah, so losing weight, getting healthy, that's my journey, that's what I'm on at the moment and it's something I want to continue on. Health is for life, isn't it? Health is wealth. So although I'm doing these videos on a daily basis, they don't take me long, they're only two, three minute videos. But it's about the walking, isn't it? The 40 minutes, the 30 minute walking that I'm doing and then maybe the hour, hour and a half walking I do with the family in the evenings. That's what it's all about. And using this video to look back on, for me, I look back on them every day to keep motivated, to remind myself why I'm doing this and to get out and get up, or get up and get out and get it done and do something today to improve your tomorrows. I have to keep reminding myself of that daily. It's become a habit, but it's something I have to keep reiterating and something I'd really strongly advise is if you find something that works, do it over and over again so it becomes a habit my case walking and, and uh, being out and about in nature is a great habit to have if you find you've got some bad habits you have to undo them and the way to undo a habit is usually to replace it with something else so if it's something that you're for example you you're in the habit of not exercising then the opposite of that would be to exercise wouldn't it um, if you're in the habit of always putting off things until tomorrow you're going to have to break that cycle by getting in a mindset of doing things straight away get up get out and get it done do something today to improve your tomorrows and get that message into you and become the person that just makes a decision the person that just gets it done and then you are the person who has to own that and live with that so if you get a reputation for getting things done that will keep building and building and building and it will keep really strengthening that um uh, that uh, that good habit within you. A beautiful tree. Sorry to be a bit distracted, but it is a beautiful place. I'm just trying to stay safe here. Um, anyway, Christmas Day tomorrow. Have a great day today. If you're celebrating on Christmas Eve, like a lot of people in the Philippines, Merry Christmas. All the best to you. And um, I'll see you again for another update video. Stay safe. Get up, get out, get it done. Do something today to improve your tomorrows and have a wonderful time and stay safe and look after each other. All the best. Merry Christmas.